This is the last wash worn by Daniel Craig as Bond, and it could be maybe the coolest he's ever worn. Debuted in 2019, a full two years before its eventual on-screen debut, the Omega Seamaster No Time to Die takes the basic design format of the Seamaster Diver 300 meter and adds a few interesting twists. For one, the watch is paired with a Milanese bracelet that along with the case are executed in grade two titanium, a lightweight material suitable for a secret agent. The dial has no date and is complete with the British broad arrow marking that denotes the status status as a British Ministry of Defense property. Very cool and subtle tie-in to Bond and Omega's history of producing watches for the British military. And despite Q saying in the film that it hadn't been tested before handing it to 007, Omega has tested these watches as master chronometers. This includes eight very stringent tests in order to get that master chronometer rating. 